Okay, okay. I've had these paints in these bottles about must be about six months, maybe even longer. Um, they've just been put to one side on the shelf and forgot about. Uh, I think we've all done that. So the white is a bit newer. Um, I mixed that up about about a month ago or something like that. All the rest of them, they, they must be at least six months old. Uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to have give them a really good shake up. I'll put some silicone in them. And I'm going to see if they still work or whether they just need to be thrown. Okay, so I'm going to start with a dirty cup. I'll get some white in there first. As I said, this white is, well, maybe a month old, something like that. And the rest of them are just really old. Might get a lot of bubbles in this because I did shake it up vigorously. So it's only to be expected. Get some blue in there. It's just a little bit of red in here. I'll just use a tiny little black. I don't use black as much as I used to. Um, because I, I just thought they were just making me paintings old. Really dark and I don't know. It's not all my paintings to be at the moment. I want them to be light and airy sort of thing. Because it's winter here and I hate winter. I just hate the dark nights. Something I've never liked. Give me summer in time. Long hot nights. There's a bit more black in there. Just top it off with white. It looks very muddy at the moment. Probably because it is. Can I risk giving it a stir? Oh, I don't think that's is going to work. Really don't. I think you should put a bit more white in there. Maybe a bit of orange as well. And these paints are a little thinner than what I use now. Just leave it there a minute. A couple of seconds. Here goes nothing. Nice cells coming up, but I want to get the paint moving before I bring the cells into play.
Could have done with a little more paint on by the looks of it. Although there should have been plenty. I think I'll just put another bit of paint down there. I don't think it was a great colour combination. Really not like me. I think I'll just leave the blue out completely on this one. I was thinking about putting another pour on top of this, on top of the like the brownish one, the first lot where I put down, but maybe for this one I can spread it out a little bit more. That don't look so bad. So we're thinking I could only use the, the first one, the the brownish one, the first pour as a background really. Well, I think I'll just may leave it like that. I'm quite liking that. You know how to work. Interesting. I think what I might do, I might put a time lapse and see how we're going from here. See um, if any of the silicone comes through. But I did really, really shake the bottles with the silicone in, so I could end up getting a lot of really small cells, or I won't say maybe even none, but uh, we'll see. We'll put on time lapse and see if anything happens. I don't think it will, but let's see. Okay, there was no cells coming up at all. Well, just from the odd ones. So, I shall now get a torch. We do have some small cells coming up. Quite interesting ones actually. <clears throat> so 
thought it reminds me of a sort of a space nebula or something like that. With tiny little asteroids about. Or is it that just me? Okay, I'll take you for some close-ups. Mm -hmm.